Hello everyone, I'm back with another Linux tutorial. Here in this video, we are going to discuss how we can install the latest version of Eclipse IDE on Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. So that being said, let's get started. Let me tell you that before installing Eclipse IDE, you have to install Java JDK on your Ubuntu system. So we already have a video on how you can install Java JDK. So I'll put the video link in the description box or you will get the video link in the i button. After you had installed Java JDK, you can follow this tutorial to install Eclipse IDE because Eclipse IDE is specially used for developing Java programs. Now to install Eclipse IDE, just open your browser and visit eclipse.org. Don't worry about the link, I'll put the link in the description box. Here, simply click on this download option. Here you'll find the latest version of Eclipse IDE download option. So the current version is Eclipse IDE 202203. Here simply click on this download option. And here you will find the download option for your Ubuntu operating system. Here simply click on this download option. And here you can see it is downloading. It is around 94 MB. So let me complete the download process. And after that we will discuss how we can set up and use Eclipse IDE to develop Java program. Our download has been completed. Now simply open the download folder. So here we have our Eclipse installer. Now simply select this Eclipse installer, right click on it and here you have to click on extract here option because this is a GIF file. After the extraction has been completed, here you will find a Eclipse folder. Simply open this folder. Inside the folder, you will find Eclipse installer folder. Simply open this and here you will find all the Eclipse installer file. Now to install Eclipse, simply click on Eclipse INST and here you will find your Eclipse installer window. Here we have our Eclipse installer window. Let me minimize the folder. So before installing Eclipse IDE for Java developer, you have to update the installer file to install the latest version of Eclipse IDE on Ubuntu. For that, simply click on this menu icon and here you will find update option. Simply click on update. Here you have to accept all the license agreement. And here you can see it is downloading the latest version of Eclipse IDE. After the download process has been completed, here you will find a trust window. Here simply click on select all and click on trust selected. And after that it will restart the Eclipse installer. Now we have the latest version of Eclipse installer on Ubuntu system. To install Eclipse IDE for Java development, simply click on Eclipse IDE for Java developers. So the latest release of Eclipse IDE is 2022.03 and here we have our Java JDK folder location and the installation folder where Eclipse IDE is going to install. So if you want to change this location, you can change by clicking on this folder icon and you can browse your location. But for now, I'm just going to keep it default. And if you want to create start menu entry and desktop shortcut, you can check this box, then click on install button. And here you have to accept the Eclipse Foundation software user agreement. Simply click on accept now. And here you can see it is installing Eclipse IDE on Ubuntu. So the installation process will take some time. Wait until the installation process completes. After the installation process has been completed, here simply click on launch. Now here you have to select your workspace directory where all your Eclipse project will be saved. After that, simply click on launch. So this is the welcome screen of Eclipse ID. Here let me maximize the window. Let me close this welcome screen. Now let me show you how you can create your first Java project using Eclipse ID. For that, here you can simply click on create a Java project. If you don't get this option here, you can simply click on file option then click on new and here click on java project and here name your project say for example demo and if you want to create a module info.java file you can check this box or else you can simply uncheck this box then click on next and here you will find your project hierarchy so demo is our java project inside this demo folder you will find a source folder 
inside this source folder all our java source code will be saved now here simply click on finish button so we had successfully created a java project and inside this java project we have our java jre system library and source folder now to create a java class simply right click on the source folder then click on new then click on class and here name your class say for example test and here simply select your modify as public and here you have to select your method let me select public static void main string argument then click on finish so this will create a simple java code now let me show you how you can print hello world using java for that here you have to write system dot out dot print ln and put parenthesis inside this parenthesis just write quotes and here write your statement say for example hello world and after completing every statement here you have to write semicolon now to run this program simply click on this run option and here click on run here click on select all then click on ok and here on the console here you will find hello world so if you want to learn java programming so we already have a beginner playlist i'll put the playlist link in the description box or you will get the playlist link in the i button so that's it this is how you can install eclipse ide on ubuntu operating system hope this video was helpful to you if you find this video helpful don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe the channel for more videos like this bye for now see you next video